Buddy, we'll ride later. Hey Lizzie, thanks for putting Champ out for me. Sure, no problem. So, what makes you late today? Well, just a little family disagreement. My mom wants me to start taking dance lessons. Ugh. Yeah, I know. I mean, there's nothing wrong with dancing. I'm just no good at it. But anyways, so what's been happening? Oh, not too much really. Just getting Pearl ready to go out to pasture. Liana, Lizzie, I would like you to meet my niece and nephew, Elizabeth and Jordan. They're going to be taking some riding lessons with us. Yeah, our parents said after Aunt Sarah teaches us everything we need to know about horses, we can maybe even get one and board it here. Wow, that's so exciting. Yeah, um, is that your horse? She's so pretty. Uh, yes, it is. Um, her name's Pearl. <laughs> so, what kind of horses do you guys want to get? Well, I'm kind of hoping for an inventing horse. I really just want a pony. And ponies are great. That's exactly what Buck is, our lesson horse. Really? Can we go meet him? Of course. You should talk some more with Leanna and Lizzie later. They ride here a lot, and they might be able to give you some tips on taking care of Buck. You mean we get to take care of him too? Oh, yes. If you're going to be getting your own horses, you will definitely need to know how to take care of them. Well, we'll be seeing you around, and have a good lesson. Well, there's Buck. So, who wants to be the first to learn how to put on a halter? <gasps> Please do me, Aunt Sarah. He is so cute. Well, I think I'll look at my tack now and take Champion out. Okay, I really need to finish up here with Pearl. Ugh, what is that awful smell? What are you talking about, Leanna? Well, come down here and you'll find out. Ew, that's really bad. Good morning, everyone. Uh, ugh, what is that smell? It's coming from Toronto's stall. Ew, this is disgusting. It looks like it hasn't been cleaned in days. I know. Teresa must not be cleaning her stall. This happened last week, too. But it's not going to happen again. Teresa, what's going on? I was just in the barn. Your horse's stall is a mess. We talked about this last week. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Sorry, Adam. I was going to do it this morning, but I guess I got a little sidetracked. You got sidetracked with what? Well, I was going to get started and I seen on my phone that I had some new messages. Messages? Yeah, on Instagram. On Instagram? Teresa, I cannot order you to take care of your horse's stall, but I can give you eight laps with no stirrups in today's lesson. Adam, come on, you wouldn't. If I were you, Teresa, I'd get started. All right, fine. It's mystery. Mystery, I haven't seen you in forever. 
It's only been a few days. Well, I guess it feels like forever. Anyways, how have you been? Can we talk? Oh, I've been actually doing really good. Uh, well, I'm going out to practice now, so I'll see you later. <sighs> um, are you okay, princess? I'm fine. Oh, yeah, okay, sure. You're fine. <sighs> Come on, princess. I can tell something's the matter. Ugh. It's my sister, Mystery. We used to be so close. Now, she just seems like she doesn't have time for me anymore. Or the stuff we used to do. She's always busier. She always has a lesson she has to go to. Maybe she doesn't want to have time for me. Well, maybe you should talk to her about it. How am I supposed to talk to her about it when she won't even chat with me? <sighs> I don't know. Okay, Jordan, don't forget to fasten your helmet. Yep, already done. Okay, so since this is your first lesson, we're just going to work on balance today. I brought you some carrots. Elizabeth, would you like to lead Buck around for your brother? Sure, that would be fun. Just do it the way we did it earlier when we got him out of the field. Perfect! You're both doing so good. So, how was your ride? Um, really good. Uh, we were practicing lead changes. Oh, that's awesome. Are you going to be in the pasture tonight? Um, they'll probably put me in my stall again. Okay, Elizabeth, you can turn Buck out in this big paddock with Princess. But Aunt Sarah, didn't you tell us that you're not supposed to put mares and stallions together unless you want them to have a foal? That's right, Jordan. I'm glad to hear that you've been paying attention. But you see, Buck's a gelding, so that means that he can't have foals with a mare like a stallion can. So it's safe to put him in any of the paddocks. And Princess seems kind of lonely lately, so some company tonight will do her good. Thanks for being a good pony today. I'm going to take Princess up to the barn to put her blanket on. It's supposed to get a little chilly tonight. You kids can plug in the water trough. That way it doesn't freeze over tonight. Okay. Okay.